Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today I have brought you all here to talk about the death of Glenn in introduction to Negan from The Walking Dead in both the show and the comics. So I'm going to first talk about how he was introduced in the show, and then I'm going to go on talking about how he was introduced in the comics with comic panels and whatnot. If you do enjoy this video, then please like and subscribe, and if you wouldn't mind commenting, it really helps out the channel. So yeah, let's get on to the video. The first appearance of Negan on screen in the TV series was episode 16 of season 6 titled The Last Day on Earth. So the introduction to Negan himself begins with him walking out of a camper, and he's basically having a prep talk with them, getting them ready for what's about to happen, how he's about to do the unimaginable, what they, they don't even know what's about to happen. So Negan is scaring everyone, everyone's terrified, you can tell by their facial expressions and everything. And then Negan says he has an idea, which is eeny, meeny, miny, mo. So he starts counting down from eeny, meeny, miny, mo on every character. And then he lands on someone, but we don't know who it is. It's just the cameraman. So it was a secret for a little bit until the next season arrived, which then we saw it was Abraham. And he ended up killing Abraham. So Abraham died in Season 7, Episode 1. After that, Daryl went ahead and decided to punch Negan in the face out of anger, which led Negan to then end up killing Glenn, which was even sadder than Abraham's death. And now everyone is depressed because two of their best friends are now dead. In the comic book, this scene is approached a bit differently, but for the most part, it stays on the same pattern as the show. We still get the same speech in the comics as we do in the show, but it's more intimidating in the comics for some reason. Which is honestly not surprising. Negan is much bigger and scarier in the comics than in the show. Unlike in the show, Glenn ends up getting picked for the bashing of a lifetime rather than Abraham because at this point in the story, Abraham is already deceased. Rick pleads and begs of Negan not to kill Glenn, but obviously Negan declines angrily. Which then leads on to the you can breathe, blink, and cry scene as Negan lifts up his bat for a very fatal swing at Glenn's head. And word for word, Negan says to Glenn exactly what he says in the show after he sees the aftermath of the hit. And it's very disturbing. For obvious reasons, I didn't show Glenn's face after he was hit in the show because I don't want to get demonetized. So I just saved a picture and made it black and white for a side-by-side -side comparison right now. Yes, it's horrific. And it is at this point in time the group is forced to watch as Nega repeatedly bashes Glenn's head in with several hits. And that's where I'm going to end it. This video was basically just a short little comparison video, introduction, and death of characters. If you made it this far into the video, then I please ask of you if you'd like, subscribe, and comment as it really helps out the channel. I'm almost at 400 subscribers. I'll catch you guys in the next video.